I think you all probably know who Tim Pool is. He is a very, very well-known podcaster. I was on his show a couple of weeks ago. He's done stuff with The Daily Wire. He's badass. His whole team is fantastic. But there's a lot of people that hate him. They hate him so much that they have called the cops on him and gotten him swatted nine times in his studio while his show is going on. Nine times. FBI, open up! Somebody else tweeted, 34,000 people watching an empty Timcast studio live. More people watching this than watch the State of the Union address and the Oscars combined. Yeah, I... <laughs> It's funny, but it's also kind of sad. It might be a positive thing, actually. Why would anybody want to watch that? Here's part of the live stream of just the empty studio. Look at that. Like, the super chats are still coming in. People are still popping off, and it's literally empty. Honestly, this could be Tim's new brand, because he also has his new chicken channel where he has cameras in his chicken coop, and he just live streams it all day long. And it's just, you know, chickens hanging around. There's no people in there. If you send in a super chat, there's like a little disco thing and the, like the chickens dance and that sort of thing. But it's literally just like quiet chickens hanging out. So maybe this is the new way to crack the code on YouTube, apparently. Here we go! Jump! You there! Up so daisy! Again, the fact that Tim Pool's empty chair is getting more views than most mainstream programming is a white pill. Yeah, okay, it is a positive thing. The fact that Daily Wire is getting better numbers than CNN, or that my YouTube channel is doing better than a lot of lefty whatever, that Tim Pool is doing better numbers than Joe Biden on Jimmy Kimmel. I genuinely think it's positive because it shows that at least part of America is yearning for some kind of content and commentary and news that is authentic that is not gaslighting people that's not bull that's not lying to their faces i don't know if this is like really changing the tide or whatever but something is shifting at least